Yo, yo, what it is? Welcome back to Rap City Rebirth. You already know I'm your host and creator, Jinx. Let's get right into the show, because we got some heat on the countdown today, you heard? Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap, but Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap, but Rap City. Rap City. City. Rap City. Now I know, I know for a fact y'all are sick and tired of hearing about this shit going around. It's been everywhere, but I gotta speak my piece on you, you know what I'm saying? This is a motherfucking music and hip-hop and rap based show. And this is a music, hip-hop, rap based thing that's going on. So I gotta speak my two cents. Chris Brown and Soulja Boy. <laughs> oh man, the beef is so hysterical. It's it's funny because, you know what I'm saying, motherfuckers beef all the time, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers get mad, motherfuckers get attitude, motherfuckers talk shit. That's normal. I'm not tripping on that. What got me tripping on this shit is, these motherfuckers are acting so damn gangster. It cracks me up because it's like just a few years ago, y'all came out and y'all was like pretty boys as they claimed them and, you know what I'm saying, cranking dance moves and shit. There was nothing, absolutely nothing gangster about these cats. But all of a sudden, a few years go by, and now y'all some motherfucking super thugs. What's crazy about that is, I ain't never seen a motherfucker get out the hood and want to go back to the hood so bad. Like, I don't even know if they are from the hood, from the jump, you know what I'm saying? But if they were, because you know what I'm saying, it's possible. They could have lived in the hood. Just because you live in the hood don't make you a gangster, you feel me? You can be from the hood and not be a motherfucking thug, you feel me? But So I don't know if they came from the hood or not, but... All I know is when they first came out, they wasn't on no gangster shit at all. And all of a sudden, these motherfuckers are super thugs. It blows me because if, you, if you're really from the hood, if you're really a gangster thug, it's one rule that you know of. Ain't no such thing as halfway crooks, okay? So if you was a gangster, you was a gangster from the jump. Y'all motherfuckers came out, y'all wasn't gangsters, now y'all are, that's what we call a halfway crook. Ain't no such thing as that, nigga. You either are or you're not. In my personal opinion, I don't think either one of these motherfuckers is gangsters. That's just me, you know what I'm saying? I know real gangsters, you know what I'm saying? So, this whole shit is just hilarious to me. But, I'm going to just say this and I'm going to say this one time. <laughs> I honestly think Chris Brown's going to beat the shit out of Soldier Boy, dog. Soldier Boy weigh about a good 80 pounds soaking wet. And that ain't even a thing. You know what I'm saying? Weight is usually not a factor unless you talk about boxing where both are professional. Like, in the streets, I done seen motherfucking little-ass kids beat up grown-ass men, you feel me? I'm just saying that Chris Brown, dog, when you see motherfuckers dancing like that, not cranking that, that, that don't take no... Nothing to dance move, Chris Brown, dude. That shit is karate, nigga. Kung Fu, Taekwondo, all that. That shit is really came from fighting, nigga. Like, that is fights. I ain't never seen Chris Brown fight. But when you see a motherfucker that dance like that and do all them flips and shit, that's fighting, nigga. That is fight. Put a nigga in front of Chris Brown while he's dancing. See if he don't kick that nigga in his fucking chin. Now, I know it's a boxing match, so it's like, yeah, but he can't do all that. But at the same time, bro, if the motherfucker can move his legs like that, you can be damn sure the motherfucker can move his hands like that. But off that, I just had to get my opinion on that. But like I said, these cats are not gangsters at all. I know gangsters, okay? And I'm about to show you a couple of them right now. Number five on the countdown. Motherfucking CDP to Don slang for none. Let's go. Pass it, nigga. You hear me? Why you slanging if you ain't making no money? Why you jacking if you ain't making no money? Why you tricking if you ain't making no money? Can't get you no money. I ain't getting no money, money, money. Why you slanging if you ain't making I'm a run with it, I'm a 
I'll send it back when I'm done with it. Hit a lick in your penny picture, what you headed for? You a dumb nigga. Leeching on a bitch, you a bum nigga. I just bought a cake for the drum, nigga. This is Gary to the 4K. Hope everybody brought a gun with him. Huh. Why you slangin' if you ain't making no money? Why you jackin' if you ain't making no money? Why you trickin' if you ain't making no money? Can't get you no money. Why you jacking if you ain't making no money? Hold up, man, I'm rapping my motherfucking shoe. Thinking ain't no money. Why you tricking if you ain't slanging no money? Why you jacking if you ain't slanging no money? Why you tricking if you ain't slanging no money? Can't get you no money. I ain't slanging no money, money, money. I get the fuck on. Money, money, no shit. Put the spaz out and take everything. BM told me I'm an asshole, told at least I didn't have my ass out Fuck a feature, cut the spaz out, nigga, fuck a feature, cut the spaz out 2017, my year, smacking every nigga with a hand out Yeah, yeah, yeah Niggas already know what the fuck it is <laughs> Niggas say they won't walk. These niggas say they won't lay down. These niggas say they won't lay them down. Top of suit, 30 rounds, lay them on the floor. These niggas say they won't walk. These niggas say they won't lay them down. These niggas say they won't lay them down. Top of suit, 30 rounds, now let's start a war. These niggas say they won't lay them down. Let that top of value out, won't even see the floor. Fourth quarter, size five, can you see the score? Yeah. Suit the whole fucking 39, need some more. All my life, I was taught, nigga, get it in. Don't need no new friends, where the fuck you niggas been? Blowing loud in the wind, you can catch 10. From this nine on my side, that's my best friend. A lot of niggas snitching, I don't know where to begin A lot of niggas wishing they would still gutter again But once you fuck up with the squad, it ain't no second chance Run up on me, try your luck, use a dead man These niggas say they won't walk These niggas say they won't lay them down These niggas say they won't lay them down Top of suit, 30 rounds, lay them on the floor these niggas say they won't walk. These niggas say they won't lay them down. These niggas say they won't lay them down. Top of shit, 30 rounds, now let's start a war. Look, use a dead man. Pull on your block, top is loud like a rock band. I know some niggas getting money, they'll drop them bands. I got some niggas in the beds and they going ham. Come to the Jeep, X around, they know who I am. Are really from the hood. Those motherfuckers are some real motherfucking gangsters. How do I know that? Cause they from Gary, Indiana, a proving gangland. On top of that, it's my hometown, so I think I know what the fuck I'm talking about. Hey, you feel me? Those motherfuckers would not be on the shit that these motherfuckers are on. Those motherfuckers would have probably been pulled up on your ass. Like this is this what blows me real real quick, real quick. I'm about to get off this topic for the rest of the year, nigga. Motherfuckers like that, if they had Soulja Boy and Chris Brown money, I'm talking millions, and you talking shit, they gonna hop on the plane, fly to your motherfucking crib and beat your ass, or probably shoot your ass, I don't know, you know what I'm saying? That's the only reason why motherfuckers in the hood don't, you know what I'm saying, bang and shit like as much, you know what I'm saying? Because they will actually come to your come to your ass, but half these motherfuckers they ain't rich, so they ain't got the kind of money to go fly across the country just to fight, you know what I'm saying, they, they'll fly across the country, but not just to fight your ass, like, that's just a waste of money, that's fucking stupid, you know what I'm saying, but I'm off that shit completely, let me go ahead and lighten up the mood, cause I know some of y'all done watch them gangster videos, and now y'all feel like y'all gangster and shit, and I don't wanna be trying to turn y'all motherfuckers into 
halfway crooks out this bitch. So we gonna lighten up the mood with a little R&B slash rap type of thing. This is coming from Manage Mania, Money Baby Remix. Yo, these cats, they going places, you hear me? They are going places, man. It's, it's something different, and I really like this record. So let's get into it. Number three, Money Baby by Manage Mania. Support, we like fans who rise. When we step up in the room, they like turning up. And every time we hit the club, I know them girls be like, Manage baby, manage baby, manage baby, yeah. Manage baby, manage baby, manage baby, yeah. Manage baby, manage baby, manage baby, yeah. That's what them girls say. Was gonna ghost. People thinking about they self, but we had to go. Then we started making moves, and now I pay the stacks. Now we ride a fancy whips, and now they coming back. Go, go, go ahead and get it. Everybody saying man, it's in a building. It don't really matter that you're telling girls you're feeling us, cause I don't really care about your feelings. And we got your girl leave behind us. We ain't worried about no cuffing. Cause these girls come and they go and they ready to go, but we already know what they came in for. It's money, baby. Money, baby. Money. But I ain't going for it. Yo, chick, no, I'm too fly. Pull up on your girl real slow like a dry back. Yeah, I dump it back right off. Then I pull up to the crib and I doze out. But my goal is the moolah. So I had to get right back up because. Yeah, we love that passion. We like getting fly. We like getting fly. Yeah, we love support. We like fans who We ride. like fans who ride. We like turning up. Oh, and every time we hit the club, I know them girls. They be like. Freak, she love when I do things to her. We in a stain tonight. Pop champagne in a stain tonight. Two, three cups, then you're looking nice. Four back cups, then you're looking bright. Uh, we like turning up and we can't turn it down. Yeah, I bet you know when man is she's around. Yeah, we Leviathan who dove to the depths with no man can swim Time to swallow your pride like a shot of gin It's hard when you're lost to find a point to begin Gotta roll with the flow like a gust of wind Pain became my ally and I embraced it like a loyal friend Fell deep into the rabbit hole when I was hard to find it into a means So it seems difficult to find someone who deems worthy When the chips are down who's ready to get they shoes and they jeans dirty Hoping that the Lord shows mercy When I mass out then I'm thirsty and forgotten 240's to my zone Got my fucking head knocking. I swear with your chest exposed, man. Your heart to go rotten. I'm feeling like the flesh shit not hot. Skid up with the grease popping. Dusting the flames off my shoulders, but jostling with my fucking heels stumping. Poised in my stands like the foundations of a mountain. When your luck runs out and your chips are down, no one fucks around with you. When your luck runs out and your chips are down, no one fucks around with you. When your luck runs out and the chips are down, no one fucks around with you. When your luck runs out and your chips are down, no one fucks around with you. 
rebellious, refusing to be ravaged by the storm. Stern, cold, and calculated, my soul's been calibrated to take loss, stand tall, and take off. Said that the proceeding got the path leading to the best outcome by tapping to my higher self, just like Malcolm X, complex with thoughts of what may become next. And then I get numb to the effects from taking bruises and blunts directly to the neck. Heavily nubriated without losing a step. Fear is only a threat, a concept that they get their possession that I have you headed to the wrong direction. This is just a poor righteous confession. The truth is so transparent, there's no need for any questions. Skill is a matter of steady progression. So just give me a second to cook up the soul food that's meant for digestion. Leave it your soul tuned, making the mind the lethal weapon. I'm a walking Smith the Wesson, destined to deposit buck shots directly to your inner thoughts. Cleaning out quantum theories all by the courts. Living in a parallel universe, I'm learning the bullshit that I was taught. When your luck runs out and your chips are down, no one fucks around with you. Man, I'm so in love with that motherfucking record. And not just because of the old school vibe, because y'all know I'm a super 90s music fan. Not just because of the old school vibe, but... You know what I'm saying? The lyrics is on point, but that ain't even what I'm talking about. It's the message in the song. When your luck runs out and the chips are down, no one fucks with you. Bruh, that shit is so motherfucking real. I've had that personal experience so many times. Like, some of y'all that's watching, I know y'all young, so y'all ain't really experienced that yet. Or y'all not y'all not paid like that, y'all not guapped up like that, you know what I'm saying? But it's nine times out of ten because you're young. Because obviously, when y'all grow up, some of y'all gonna be on y'all shit, some of y'all not gonna be on y'all shit. Some of y'all that are gonna be on y'all shit are going to fall off. And I want you to remember this day. Remember watching this video. If you ever fall off, watch how many motherfuckers disappear, man. That shit is so motherfucking real dog like it don't get no realer than that man i'm telling y'all now you don't, don't 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 try to be friend to everybody that's that's basically what i'm trying to say right here man do not try to be friend to everybody when you get on your shit only fuck with the motherfuckers that was with you before you even got on in the first place you know what i'm saying if you got a little like a little uh a rap crew or something like that right say you just i'm just using that for example because Look at the show. <laughs> Say you got a rap group, right? And y'all like ninth, tenth grade or whatever. If them motherfuckers ain't with you though, from that, from the time y'all start that shit to the time one of y'all blow up or all y'all blow up, don't fuck with them. Let's say y'all got a rap group, y'all started in ninth grade, right? Boom, tenth. 11th, motherfuckers start falling off. Motherfuckers like, you know what I'm saying, giving up, quitting. They tired. They don't want to do it no more. They lost their motivation. They get to the falling off. Your senior year, you blow up. Get on double XL and tour out of the country or some shit. Do not let them niggas fuck with you, bro. Do not. Because the second you fall off, if you fall off, God forbid that you do fall off. But if you do fall off. Them motherfuckers is gonna take off like a goddamn rocket. I'm trying to tell you, man. That's why I love that record so motherfucking much. All right? Now, before we get into the number one on the countdown, I just gotta say I'm happy for these cats because last episode they came in at number two, but this time they came out with some shit, and I was like, oh. Damn, this is definitely number one on the motherfucking countdown this time. It's the little people with bodies. Understand me, bruh. The lyrics are cold. The motherfucking beat is cold. The motherfucking... Just everything about this, the vibe is cold. Everything about this record is just like... Ugh. Like, I don't know if any of y'all is from the hood, but you know, if you in the hood, if you from the hood or in the hood or anything like that, even been to the hood, and you get in the car... And something is banging. Like, you know what I'm saying? Back when I was younger, it was probably like around uh, Jeezy would bang. You know what I'm saying? And you get in that car and you see motherfuckers like this, like, with the ugly face and they just rocking their head like, oh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> this is that record that I have you and your homies in the car with them ugly faces looking at each other like, oh, from the lyrics to the beat to the vibe, all that. On top of that, the motherfucking visuals is clean. So here's number one on the countdown, the little people with bodies. 14 for suspicion, 55 rounds down run. Mind on my money. Chuck it back in the diet. Looking for me. Well, it's gonna be a riot. King of the jungle. Nigga, you lying. Threw me to the wolves. Howling over bodies. Mind on my money. Chuck it back in the diet. To the 
wolves. wolves. Now I'm howling over bodies. bodies. I'm hungry. Bodies. You can throw me butt naked in the jungle when I come out with a with a chinchilla coat, a leopard hat, and ten pounds heavier for eating them niggas. They hunt me with police and pistols that issue stay close, man, I swear, I do not care. Lions and tigers and bears, yes, I do see them, but I am not scared, yeah. Belly of the beast trying to see what's in there. Teach me how to eat, play for keeps and don't share. Ain't worry about beef, just keep me in your prayers. I run with no fears, yeah, yeah. Full course meal, turkey bacon is my side dish, uh. Did away with that swine shit, I don't just hate a pig, I fucking despise it. Uh, I did away with my side bitch. She got a bad habit, always bad mouthing my bitch. Uh, don't nobody talk about my bitch. Uh, unless them words come from my lips. Uh, I'm the king of the jungle. Guess that mean I'm the man. If you try me, then I'ma catch a body, and I'm working with Randy Moss hands. They hate to see me doing good, but that's what I prefer. They done threw me to the wolves, and I came out wearing the fur. They say, nigga, you lie. They done threw me to the wolves. Now I'm howling over bodies. Mine on my money. Talking bacon in my diet. I heard it looking for me. When it's gonna be a riot. I'm the king of the jungle. They say, nigga, you lie. They done threw me to the wolves. Now I'm howling over bodies. Y'all know about it, you jokes. But if you throw me out to the jungle, I had a motherfuckers dance. <laughs> Be like one of the greatest. This ain't about what I want, this is solely about what I gotta do. Instinct survival, you idle too long, and this money done cleared all my sinus too. Been wild since I caught the common cold. Why don't you learn how to fend for yourself while you crossing these obstacles? It's getting quiet, too quiet for you to approach my house without being shot at. Too paranoid for that, better start to announce yourself or get popped at a time that's more opportune. For this rondo to rendezvous by number nine, or some NC Miyaki to cover the smell, bodies the fertilizer. You sleep with you, so I'm just hoping my harvest grew. Got on her knees, pull on weed, grab my garden tools. And she knocked out like tiny says your father used. Not round the two, control lies via fire. Come, yeah. Yeah, bodies in peripheral vision, zombie shit apocalyptic, lights up in my river mirror. I don't even fit descriptions, curtain close, no intermission, all the space you cannot enter. Fuck the ghost is giving, giving, living with the quickest tip of finger, slipping, nigga, trigger, catch you like a killer, whipping, triple dipped in making dishes. I for mailing all you niggas, we ain't doing split decisions. Call this shit a premonition, Simpsons with the Trump dick shit. But my hand on my money, money, turkey bacon in my diet. I heard it looking for me, well, it's gonna be a riot. They say, nigga, you lie. They done threw me to the wolves. Now I'm howling over bodies. I can already tell all y'all is sitting right there watching with the ugly face right now. Like, oh, yo, I'm telling you that record is hardcore. Matter of fact, on top of that, every record that I played today was some hardcore shit. So with that being said, go to the links in the description and check out the full videos of all them joints. The full videos because you know videos got a lot of shit in them so in this show a lot of shit is cut out so definitely you know what I'm saying go check out your favorite record on the countdown let, let them know the jinx sent you you know what I'm saying in the comment section please send me either your videos or your friends videos or something like that you know what I'm saying if you want them to be on the countdown or if you want to be on the countdown yourself or you can send them to my twitter you can hit me up on instagram you can even hit me up on my facebook just link me to that shit, and I'll hit you up, you know what I'm saying, if I'm rocking with it, if I'm not, I'm just not going to hit you up, I'm sorry, yo, if you're trash, I'm not going to hit you up, so make sure you your bars is tight, you know what I'm saying, you're putting in that work, make sure your visuals is clean, if you want to be on here, you feel me, I, this is Rap City, people, okay, I know some of y'all don't know what Rap City was, the original Rap City, but this is Rap City, we can't have whack stuff on here, you know what I'm saying, it's nothing personal, it's just that I refuse to to let down BET and Big Tigger and all of them that have something to do with Rap City. I refuse to let it down, so I'm not putting garbage on this show. I don't care if you got bars, but your video look like it was recorded on a damn cell phone. I'm not doing it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I just can't let this show do that, all right? So like I said, man, link is in the description to each and every video in the comment section. Tell me how you feel about this show, man. And uh, I hope y'all stick around for the next episode.
Peace. Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap for Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap City. Rap for Rap City. Rap City. City. Rap City.